Ronnie James had a cardiac arrest during practice, and now he is back. Ronnie will soon be back on the basketball court. To see him come back and to be on the court. This kid's got a lot of potential. It's going to be real interesting to see what he does moving forward with USC. First step was just time. Uh, first, like, month, month and a half. Um, I wasn't really doing anything, just stretching. It just slowly progressed after that. I, I started jogging, walking, and then it just kept progressing week on week. He did a great job. He really worked hard. Uh, there were days where he would voluntarily come in um, and just, uh, he wanted to get back on the court. And like I said, we did a progression for it and uh, it worked out well. I'm pumped, very excited to get back on the court with my guys, excited to play. This season, four months after suffering cardiac arrest, Bronny James makes his collegiate debut. As the Trojans get it back, three on two, Bronny in transition, pull up three, that's good! Bronny James Jr. with the first bucket of his USC career. You know, obviously there was a lot of people coming to see him, there was a lot of tension around him returning to the floor, and he went in there and played within himself, he played with poise, he played under control. And that's very hard for young people, especially with all the attention that he was getting. And so he just fit in. I thought he, he played positive basketball. I thought he impacted winning. I thought we were better on the floor when he was out there. On the other way, and here's Jaden Jones, rejected by Bronny James. Big thing with me is just defense. I, I take pride in playing defense. So, you know, me playing defense, I feel like everyone else is, would just feed off that. And we can be a great defense. I know we can be a great, great defensive team. So I feel like, me, you know, me coming out and focusing on that, it would, would help us a lot. What are some of your takeaways? I would just say be thankful for everything you have. Um, you actually don't, you really don't know if you're going to wake up the next day. So just, just taking everything in, in this moment, this moment right here, and just being thankful for everything you have.